afternoon. I'm Mike Peterson with the latest from the KMA Newsroom on this Monday afternoon. Discussion regarding unloading another city property is on the Shenandoah City Council agenda for tomorrow night's meeting. Meeting at 6 p.m. at City Hall, the council is expected to discuss a proposal regarding the proposed sale of the city's old water plant at 204 Grass Street. Shenandoah City Administrator A.J. Lyman told KMA News a developer has approached the city with a proposal to renovate the structure, which has been vacant since the city's new $12 million facility went online in 2017. Montgomery County residents may resume open burning after resulting uh, consulting rather with area fire chiefs. Montgomery County Emergency Management Coordinator Brian Hammond today ordered the burning ban lifted immediately. Dry, windy conditions sparked numerous brush fires, forcing the county to implement the burn ban earlier this month. But Hammond tells KMA News this morning recent rainfall improved conditions. As brush fires in KMA land become more common, one area fire department is looking to upgrade its rural field and brush fire equipment, Red Oaks Fire Department, in conjunction with the Red Oak Volunteer Fire and Rescue Association, is raising funds to purchase a brush truck. Red Oak Fire Chief John Bruce told us that they intend to replace the current vehicle that has begun to show some wear and tear. And Red Oak school officials continue to deliberate the best course of action regarding cell phone usage during school hours. Discussion took place at the recent Red Oak School Board meeting. KMA on track weather, mostly cloudy today, highs of the mid-60s, south to southwest winds 5 to 10. Mostly cloudy tonight, lows in the lower 40s, partly sunny on Tuesday, highs of the low 60s. More news at 5.05 and 6.05 this evening and online at kmaland.com. Have a good rest of your Monday. Mike Peterson, so long, my friend.